Good evening and thank you for watching. Mika Miyashima has the night off. With the recent earthquakes at Mauna Loa, Big Island officials and scientists were being proactive tonight by meeting with local residents. They want people to know an eruption is not imminent, but they do want them to be prepared. KITV4's Jeremy Lee listened in on the meeting tonight and has more on our top story. Jeremy. Well, Rick, officials on the Big Island are warning residents to be prepared as the world's largest active volcano is showing increased activity. Mauna Loa is not erupting, but there have been several earthquakes lately, 19 small magnitude quakes in just the past 24 hours. An advisory meeting wrapped up this evening in Pahala. Community meetings are being held across the Big Island to prepare those who live on the slopes of Mauna Loa in case the volcano does erupt. Now, officials recommend residents pack a go bag in case they need to evacuate or relocate. Also recommended having a plan to reconnect with family members if separated. Mauna Loa, the other thing that makes it dangerous is it does not give us much warning. Kilauea is generally much kinder to us than Mauna Loa is, but generally Mauna Loa gives us one, two, three hours you know, before the eruption starts, and oftentimes it will move down the rip zones in an equal amount of time. It can move very, very rapidly. Officials emphasize that an eruption is not imminent, as we said. Now, they don't want people to panic. Mauna Loa has not erupted for 38 years, since 1984, but the Big Island's population has nearly doubled since that time, so they want people to be informed. The U.S. Geological Survey has developed a color-coded warning system to alert those in rift zones should a situation arise. Mauna Loa currently is at yellow alert. Reporting live, Jeremy Lee, KITV4 Island News.